Welcome back to Kicking It With Kenya. I'm still joined by the beautiful Ami on the couch and my co-host Lewis. You know, I always get into these topics that I like to just challenge, I guess, relationships or situations and things like that, or just to get clarity around how to form relationships and bonds and things like that. So something kind of like personal to me. So for instance, I was with someone and he, we kind of was talking about standards and boundaries, things you're willing to give up, things that's a hard no-no, like this is me. And obviously you think about the bigger things, which is like cheating and stuff like yeah. that. But what about those little day-to-day -day things that probably, is it personality that you're not willing to change or is it something you want to give up or you can give up for a relationship? So for example, um, me and him had like a, uh, Differences in when it came to dancing at a party. So, you know, dancing at a fit. He was not with it when it comes to me being out with girls, dancing with guys. That was something that was big, like, eh, 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 eh. Mm -hmm. So, I'm thinking along those lines. How do you, one, how do you guys feel about that? Dancing? Like, the... Dancing. Like, you're well, doing... where is he from? He's Haitian. Oh. Uh, he yeah, well, we was, he's Haitian. Okay. That's why I, I, that's why everybody looked like me, so I don't want to stand. Yeah, you don't understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's Asian. Yeah. So, but I'm just saying, like, when it comes to dancing in a party, like, that's where we're going to start with that one. K, yay or nay? Uh, yay. You can dance. You can go ahead and dance in the party. You don't have no issue with your man, with your, with his man no. getting wine. I mean, he's Jamaican. He's he like the fets. No, not even just do, uh, in general. You don't care. No. You know what about you? I'm single. But when you so. were. Mm -hmm. I ain't been in a relationship for a while, but um, it doesn't really bother me, to be honest. If you're having a girl's night out, you're having a girl's night out, do what you do. It doesn't really bother me at all. You're coming home to me. Right. So, uh, you care. Right. So, that would be like the... I'm not... I'm, wait a second. I trust oh, the wait, 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 wait. She's like, wait, wait, wait. She's like, wait. Wait. I, it depends on... Like, like I said, I know that... I always say this is a circumstance. There's a circumstance to the dancing. Like if you're at a fet and you know she's winding up on you or whatever and it's just that. But they not playing no bump and grind and then you know somebody is sensually dancing so the on you. No, just I just feel like you're not, I don't want I I mean personally, at the end of the day, you don't know what they're doing when they're at the party. Right, he's right, as long as they're coming up to you. But in my mind, I don't want I wouldn't want to see him. Bumping and grinding R. Kelly in with some girl. <laughs> R. Kelly. Yeah. Like, soul jams is the line. Yeah, yeah. Like, I wouldn't want... But if that happens, I wouldn't know. I'm home. I wouldn't know. If I'm there, he's not going to do that, you know? But I'm home. I wouldn't so when know. you're together, no dancing with other people. Oh, he's not going to be dancing with other people. But at what? a fet, yes. Oh, like, even at a fet? You don't mind if he's dancing with other girls? No, 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 he's no, no, no. You're there? no, 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 no. He can dance with other people at a fet. I can dance with other people at a fet. Oh, I, okay. Yeah. That's a different spin on it. Yeah. Some people be like, well, we're together. No. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of like, I, I guess, I sometimes how I am. I'm like, yeah. right, we're together. Okay, cool. But if you're not, then do whatever you want to do. Yeah, but no. you just don't care either way as long as it's respected. If it's at like one of them carnivals, like you oh know, yeah, them, like a them parades and stuff. Yeah, I wouldn't mind with the costume people. Do your or thing. Even at the strip club, if the girl is dancing on him, I wouldn't mind. I don't care about stuff like that. But if we're at like a lounge or like a you know something like that, and I'm there and some girl starts winding up on him, I don't, I wouldn't. But you we're know, at a lounge. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like like I said, time and place. You know. Yeah. So when it comes down to that stuff, so you said you you don't care. Even when you're there? No, if I'm if I'm there, that's different. Mm -hmm. But I'm talking about like you said, like girls' night out, girls are having fun, whatever, whatever. That's just the trust that I have right. in the person I'm with. You know, I trust that you're not gonna go Wild over out. the line here. Yeah. But just have fun. I'm not gonna be sitting there just no, you can't do this, can't do that. Eh, mm -hmm. I trust you. But I'm not saying she. I, I, if, correct me if I'm wrong. She's not saying that um, whether you trust her or not to do it. Would you be okay with her doing it? Like well, I Kelly and Bobby Brown. See it. Yeah, that's my so thing. That's I would see like, it. If, if yeah. you're out with your girls, you wouldn't know. I would like, right, know. So I'm gonna chill. Yeah. I'm gonna chill with the homies, and we gonna chill out. Whatever. Right. So I'm not gonna think about like, oh, uh, what if she's there and this song comes. I'm not gonna think about none of that. You know what I'm right. saying? Like I just do your thing, have fun. I don't want. I don't necessarily have to see it. You know what I'm saying? That's what I said. Like, if we're out together, that's different. But if you're just going out with your friends, yeah, have fun. Yeah, because honestly, like, so I when we when we were once a couple, 
I did try that. I'm like, okay, yeah, girls night out. Like, when we were together, I was trying to respect his wishes. I'm like, all right, I'm not going to dance with nobody else. It was whack. Like, you're really sitting there at a girls night out, and you're just, you're watching your friends live in La Vida Loca, and you're just sitting there nursing your drink. Wait, no, no, he, was, he wasn't at the girls night out. No. Okay, okay. But it's like, that's whack. Like, that's so boring. Like, I'm sitting there, and I'm, I mean, I was respecting the wishes, but I'm like, this is not me. The Kenya that I am, I love to have fun. I like to party. I like to do the things I like to do. And it felt like in a weird way, my, me doing that was kind of like giving me visceral pain, if that made mm -hmm. sense. So I, it kind of made me think, all right, is this something, because I guess in his mind, he's like, it's just dancing. But I'm like, it's not just dancing. It's something that's part of me. Mm -hmm. I like to go out. I like you, You've seen me in the club. Yes, yes. Like, I'm always... Bouncing right, around, yes. making friends, like I'm a social person. By the way, we need to do that again. We definitely do. We definitely do. Yeah, okay, but I'm like, talk. I'm a social person. I love to be outside. I like mm -hmm. to, especially when I'm with my girls, like, you know, I can make a friend with your friends. You don't got to worry about me if you yeah. bring me somewhere. Yes. I can do whatever yeah, I want to do. But it's like, a lot of that does correlate with dancing and with being festive. When you're, when you're opening like this, you give stitch vibes. No. No. No, like, that's not me. Mm -hmm. So then I started thinking deeper about things like, all right, what are you willing to give up for a relationship? Because on the surface, something like dancing seems so small. Mm -hmm. So even going on to like, for instance, um, the other thing was smoking weed. Mm -hmm. He had a very strong no weed policy mm -hmm. at all, at all. Mm -hmm. I tried that as well. <laughs> Socially, I like doing it. Okay. So it's just like, but it's like, it, it got to a place where I'm like, all right, let me try giving it up. I'll, like, I, so it's like, it'd be those little things where like, are you really going to risk a relationship? Here's or, the thing, there's no umbrella, like, uh, you know, definition of what is allowed and not allowed in a relationship. I just feel like every relationship is personalized and individualized to who you are, right? So, who you are before you met this person, I just feel like you should remain that way. As long as you're not disrespecting this person. I don't think that there's a problem with you. He's not, he can't, he doesn't know what you're doing. You person, here's a, like, for example... He doesn't know what you're doing out there. You in your heart know that you're not going to be disrespecting him or doing anything crazy. You know what I mean? Dancing is dancing. You're right. not. Just respect yourself and respect him. If you're going to a party, you can go ahead and do a little two-step with a guy. You know what I'm saying? But don't be freaking R. Kelly and grinding and freaking. You just really focus on this. Or, like, don't, don't be lifting that leg up. <laughs> don't, don't, don't wrap your leg around him and do all that crazy stuff. You know what I'm saying? There's levels to things. Like, you can go ahead and give a little wine. Yeah, like a one, two, three. Oh, you like that? Oh, it's, it's not your voice, it's mine and somebody else. You know what I mean? Like a little, you know what I'm saying? You're an attractive woman. What the hell? Like he didn't freaking, he, he wants you because you're you. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like you shouldn't have to change that. You shouldn't have to change that. And that's, that's the point I'm trying to make. So like, like I said, this was like an old relationship that kind of just generated conversation like in my head. So it's like, when does it get to a point in a relationship or when you meet somebody where you, will you say, this is me? But when do you, when do, when, I'm trying to figure out how to say it. Like, when do you, guys, let me help me. Like, you know, how some, me. you know how somebody be like, this is who I am. This is who I am. This is who I am. Yeah. But when do you be like, okay, let me try and change for this relationship. Yeah, but when, when's that? Like, I feel when like, like, when is that? Okay, you say this is who I am. This is who you are when you're single. Now it's like, this is who I am in a relationship. So how, how so, would you translate that? Or when do you know what's what you can and cannot do um you, when you're in a relationship I, it's, it's so crazy because i was raised to believe a, a relationship different from marriage my culture is very all right this is your boyfriend but this is not your husband type of thing so it's it's a very tough one so when you say relationship but this man you're hoping that he is you're hoping husband. that he is but that individuality should still remain like your decisions you your traditions your decisions should be about you first and then your relationship. If your decisions that you're making like don't correspond, like don't, like the relationship doesn't agree with it, then maybe that's not the relationship for you. Because you remember, this is before marriage. How, how, how long can you sit there and be something you're not? It, 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 if you, with the long time you do it, you get married, everything messes up. You get a divorce and stuff because you didn't marry the person that forms to who you, who you are. So, so your, your, your thing is, you should be an individual yes. in a boyfriend-girlfriend situation and yes. hope you meet another individual that aligns to you. 
Is that what you're saying? No, I'm saying that you should maintain your individuality in a boyfriend-girlfriend relationship because that's not your husband, that's not your wife. You know what I'm saying? So I wouldn't say go not go to a party and be yourself and all that other stuff. I, I believe that you should. And that person should accept you for who you are because that's your boyfriend, that's your partner. You know what I'm saying? And that's not your, your sorry, that's your boyfriend, not your your life. That's Long not your, life. yeah. Yeah, but. Boy, yeah, the, life is too short for that. No, I'm sorry. But it's also like, okay, I agree with that as well. Like being an individual in a relationship and keeping your individuality. But how are you ever going to get to that other level of marriage if there's not some sort of compromise at some point? Because um, if this person says that this is something, let's just say they're a good man, mm -hmm. you know, or a good woman, mm -hmm. and they're good, they're because that what that was that was basically the issue. That was the circumstance in that past relationship. Mm -hmm. He wasn't a terrible man. He was a good man. Yeah, good so, old friend. But <laughs> yeah, he was a good man. But he asked for like. No, no dancing, then no that's way. not no, then that's not the person for you. I'm sorry, it's not. So so the person has to accept all of it? They have they don't have to accept all of it, but they have to work with all of it. You don't have to change yourself for your boyfriend. I feel like you yourself are how you are, he himself is how he is, and you come to a middle ground. Like you don't have to change yourself. Okay, you wanna go I'm what is it? What are you gonna do? Leave? Would you that that means that I'm like you said, I, that's not me. How miserable, like that's so miserable. I want to go to a party, I want to have fun and do things that I want to do, that, that you want to do. So how, how miserable is that for me to say, oh, I got to sit here and act like somebody I'm not because of my boyfriend. I don't have a ring. Oh, <laughs> Come on, boyfriend. You know boyfriend. what I'm saying? Yeah, that's, you know, that's not my husband, that's my boyfriend. No, be yourself. And if he can't deal with it, then he's not the man for you. Right. He's not. How do you feel There's about men, that yeah, there's men that you would be, would be good men just like him, but would accept everything. Everything. Right. That's not your person then. That makes sense. What about the compromise level? We always laughing and stuff. Because <laughs> I feel like he's about to say something that always turned the conversation to <laughs> No, 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 no. I mean, to be honest, I wouldn't necessarily consider myself like the typical guy in terms of things. Like, I'm pretty easygoing. What's so your sign? Sorry. I'm a Leo. Okay. We're both Leos. <laughs> so your life is play. For me <laughs> personally, Leo's. like, I. I more so try to, I'm more so the person in a relationship that tries to conform to what the person I'm with likes. So you conform. It's just me. Like if I know if I'm if I know you like to dance or you like doing this or you like doing something that you've been doing since before I met you, I don't feel it's right for me to come in and say, oh no, I don't, you don't. Do it. It's like I, I use an example. I go to strip club. <laughs> I have strippers that are friends. Many people have said to me. Could you, could, could you date a stripper? I said, if I met them as a stripper and I chose to date them, yes. Because I, I wouldn't change that about them. That's exactly. what they do. That's what they were with. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like, to me, that's different, is, that's different as if... It's different if you never did it. We get together, we get married, and then yeah. you want to do it. That's different than if I met you and you were already doing this. Yes. Like, I don't really believe necessarily... Like, yeah, there's compromising in certain aspects, but I, I don't want to change who you are. Mm -hmm just because I may feel a little uncomfortable with that. If something really, really bothers me, like, I will let you know, we can have a conversation about it. Like, the thing, the examples you brought up don't really bother me. Right. Smoking, do I smoke? No. Do I like smoke? No. But I have friends, I've dated someone that smoked. It doesn't really, if you want to smoke, do you think? Same, right. It doesn't really bother me like that. I may not be in the car with you while you're baking it out. Exactly. But, <laughs> you're right. baking it out. Yeah. That's me too, yeah. Yeah, same thing as if you like, like the dancing thing. It's like, oh, go let it out. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Or if I'm that uncomfortable, then to me, it's just like, in my mind, my mind will go towards like, you know what? Do let I me take it to some spots. Let me let me be the guy that you're that you're that you're doing this with. You know. So what I'm if saying? she's like, gonna go out, then I want to make sure I'm yeah. gonna be part of it. Like if 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 I feel that insecure about it, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, it's Do you think it's an insecurity? So once rare, again, what a rare breed. So we what, need more of you. But so my thing is, once we again, do. is it an insecurity or is it just want their standard? So that's why I'm also trying to think about that. I love what you just said. Like if you're uncertain about what your partner is doing your this is boyfriend and girlfriend right this is how you develop into husband and wife right go check it out go see for yourself you know what i'm saying figure out what why is this person so sparky about this okay this person wants to do this it makes me uncomfortable because i don't know about it let me go figure it out let me go let me go see how they are in their element okay this is who they are you love me you're not gonna disrespect me you're not gonna cheat on me whatever all right do your thing like this is why 
I don't know. Um, it, 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 I, mar that's, this is also another reason why marriages do not last too. Because it's like, you didn't go through those phases. You didn't go through those steps. You to didn't take your time to learn your partner well. You know what I'm saying? And also, it's a cultural thing too. This is the way I was raised in my culture, my parents, and, and things like that. Like, like I said. Can you let everybody know what your culture is? Oh, I'm Nigerian. I'm Nigerian. And they, we don't really place much emphasis on a boyfriend. I've never really brought anybody home to my parents. They don't place... They only place emphasis on somebody that you're telling them that you're presuming that this is going to be your fiance. An engagement. An engagement. This is, all right, I, I want to marry this person. I think I want to marry this person. You know what I'm saying? Because all the boyfriend, girlfriend stuff really is trial and error. It's really trial and error. So it's like that boyfriend, girlfriend phase is you figuring out if we mesh well enough. Because not everybody you mesh, you, you mesh well enough to be a husband with. Right. This is a, could, supposed to be your friend that's supposed to take you to New Heights or something. You know what I mean? You met this person. That this doesn't mean that, oh, I love this person. I'm infatuated with this person. doesn't mean that this person is meant to be your husband or wife. You know what I'm saying? That's why they say sometimes, I think they say um, marriage is a uh, transaction. Because there's different levels to it. You gotta look at everything. You gotta look so at So you have this relationship that grew into something that now you yeah. wanted to share your assets yeah. with. Yeah.